Welcome back, everyone. Twitch is here, and I am back yet again to talk about some awesome new additions for your collections from Iacon 3D Labs, nostalgic displays for geeky collectors. I'll put all their information down in the description below. But yes, we have some new crazy display options for Ninja Turtles and Gargoyle. Starting it off, we have these really cool adapters. I'm really interested to see how these work. These will work for the NECA Toys Goliath action figure. And it kind of lets you display his giant wings. If you know the Gargoyles line, you know they have giant wings. You have several different stands with different sized pegs for various NECA TMNT. We'll say the cartoon figures, but we'll try out a lot of different NECA Ninja Turtle figures. But uh, I really like these in particular. They're just simple. They're, they're just the turtle stands, you know? And then we have this giant display piece for... Goliath, or you could really say for any Gargoyles figure, however I'll show you, this one is specifically designed for Goliath. It's actually pretty darn cool. You can see how a lot of it is uh, hollow underneath. It's actually quite a hefty piece, I'll tell you. But on the sides right here, these little drawers come out, and you can store all of Goliath's different accessories. The hands, the books... If I can get this thing open right here. The, you could say the jalapeno pepper, right? Jalapeno! There's a little spot for it right there. Isn't that cool? A little shape. <laughs> Can't miss it. You can also put the book in there as well. So, very cool. Again, I'm very interested to see how this will all display. I'm very interested in all the stands and how those will display. So sit back, relax, grab yourself a nice hot cup of coffee. This is a look at some brand new offerings from Iacon 3D Labs. And while I got all you 3D printers here, I just want to say thanks so much for always checking out my videos. If you haven't already, please do consider subscribing. Old toys, new toys, daily news updates. Guarantee you'll find something here that you like. So, we're just going to jump right into it. We got all the stands right here. Now, keep in mind, this is the Channel 6 stand. And there are different versions when you go to order them on their website. The little pegs on here are specifically designed, or what I'm told they're designed for, April. If you have the April O'Neil action figure, this will hopefully fit. The Ninja Turtle one, pretty much self-explanatory. You can get them in various sizes, but this will work for turtles, right? You can actually see the difference between the two. April's would be a little bit more flat, and the turtles are a little bit longer. So they'll fit, and you know how peg holes go on various figures. The same thing with the gray stand. They're pretty much the same thickness through and through, but... The pegs will vary, and they try to give you a full range to match all the different figures. And the same thing with the Foot Clan. We'll try Foot Soldier, Shredder, everybody, all the villains. I like the foot right there. That's a nice purple that they got going on. So, to kind of kick it off, we'll just go with what they're advertising. April O'Neil, Michelangelo, let's get a Rocksteady going, and then to finalize it, we'll get a foot soldier right there so we'll see how april fits first and foremost so she does have more of a rounder wider peg hole right and i'm going to be honest with you they do mention on their site as well that it really depends on the figure it's all about how the plastic is kind of sculpted also kind of enlarging the pegs yourself you know what i mean it's it's completely up to you but i gotta tell you as much as i try to fit her on this stand my April just won't fit. To try Michelangelo, no. He's, and and this, this particular stand is not designed for Mikey. The green ones, though, definitely do fit. And what I do like about that is that it's, it's very much in the vein of Ninja Turtles. I, I mean, through and through, it's green. It says Turtles right on there. And he stays really nicely on there. So, very cool home run for the Ninja Turtle stand. Now, to try, let's say, the gray stand with some of the enemies, right? Rocksteady, for instance. It looks to be that this will be yeah, pretty much a good fit. I think that we're getting... Yeah, so I could honestly tell you that Rocksteady will fit with the gray version. And just make sure, again, when you're ordering that you choose the right size. But uh, yeah, this definitely works nice and flat. Should keep Rocksteady aloft and then you have the foot soldier with the really cool i just really like that purple that just really stands out very cool for the foot clan and i gotta tell you i tried a couple foot soldiers not every foot soldier worked oddly enough and as you can see you really have to push down on it 
But after you kind of wiggle it in there, yeah, it stays pretty well. I mean, he's he's definitely on that stand. So just go easy. Just know what you're ordering. But for the most part, yeah, they do work. Except for the Channel 6 one. That's the one I had a little bit more of a, a problem with. Now with Vern here, let's see if we can get him going. He's a Channel 6 news member. They do list him on the website. And that works. So you can definitely do Vern. Vern, you know what? No, he's... Not going to work. His peg holes on the bottom of his feet are entirely too large for this particular style of Channel 6. So we're going to say that so far just Vern works. No go on Vern. And I'm going to be honest with you, the way that Irma's feet, I don't think these are going to work. So that's also a no on Irma. So Vern works best for me for the Channel 6. Now, if you wanted to use Shredder with the Foot Clan stand, which I really hope that this works let's see if we can get yeah that seems to be going pretty well let's just uh oh, no ah uh, yeah this one it's uh the peg holes well you can kind of sort of get it in there it's not very steady bebop on the other hand let's see can't no that doesn't it's it's his peg holes are too small but on the gray stand for this particular version the one that rocksteady worked out really well yeah that'll work for Bebop. I was a really lopsided Bebop, by the way. And then what I also kind of found out was if you don't want to go the NECA Toys cartoon route, the Channel 6 one couldn't really find anything, but the green works with the movie turtles, the gray works for Leatherhead, and then, yeah, you can use the Mirage for the purple stance. So it's kind of a toss up on a wide variety of figures to use. Heck, even Super 7, that works, and then both the last Ronin figures. One worked for the gray and one worked for the purple. So again, all the peg holes and all the different characters, it's going to vary. But I'll tell you right now, what works the best, and in this case, use your imagination, all the turtles have the green stands. I think that's solid. That'll make your collection pop. So I'll tell you honestly, I can't recommend all the stands, but I will tell you that the green stands work awesome for the Ninja Turtles. Which brings us to Goliath with his giant, really cool Castle Wyvern block right from the castle that's awesome right but we need to test out some wingage now i'll tell you right now i think the one missing thing that i would have liked is uh maybe a couple pegs peg holes something to keep him more in line because it makes me nervous he does stand but you know how that goes now you can put all the hands in one drawer just like that and on the other side the jalapeno and the book go on the other side perfectly like beautifully right then you have these extenders right here and at first i didn't really know what to think the purple kind of sort of matches it matches enough to really get these wings going and when you plug them in i was actually blown away i was like wow this actually works this is pretty cool if you know the gargoyles line the wings are very cumbersome this allows you to really have a little bit more extra space in your collection. It folds down really nicely. Of course, just go easy with your wings. But I honestly had no problems inserting them or taking them out. It didn't ruin any of the holes in his back or the wings. So that's a good thing. However, it still becomes quite top heavy. And I think that's where the base stand with some peg holes would be better for me, for my taste, just not to have to worry about him taking yet another tumble. You know what I mean? But uh, in either case, yeah, that looks pretty darn cool. And just the fact that you can get the wings kind of more outstretched, you know, in that opening titles when he like roars in the night. I wish I could get the arms up a little bit more. That's the articulation right there. But you can see that with these extenders, as simple as they are, it does work. So yeah, I would definitely grab them. And they're only eight bucks unless you want the stand and everything else. You can get a combo deal, but uh, those are on pre-order. Again, I'll put all the links down below. But here's what the wings look like without. And now without the extenders, I'm kind of like, yeah, kind of digging those a heck of a lot more. You can even put them down. It's just that the base works with keeping up higher so the wings have somewhere to go. If you catch my drift there. So yeah, home run for the wings. And yes, you can use the base for any number of the other gargoyles. It's just that this one has all the drawers specifically for 
Goliath. Like if you wanted to put Hudson up there too with his big wings, I wouldn't say that Goliath's little extenders work with any of the gargoyles just yet. Again, this is mainly for Goliath, so treat it as such. But uh, yeah, if you're a Goliath fan, it's definitely going to work. So that will wrap it up for my look at some of the brand new offerings from Icon 3D Labs. The Goliath accessories are on pre-order now, so you can head over to the website. I'll put all the links down below. And then choose accordingly with the turtle stands. Again, I'll definitely recommend them, but just know what you're getting. But hands down, the turtle stands, the green turtle stands work really well for the Ninja Turtles. So, you've heard my thoughts. Now I'm curious to know yours. Comment below, let me know. Let's talk everything Icon 3D Labs. And thank you again to Icon for sending these out for the purposes of showing these all off. And happy holidays to you all. And I'm going to leave you guys with that. As always, drink some great coffee, eat some great food. But most importantly, remember, when it comes to 3D printing, I don't know how it works. But dang it all, if these aren't awesome. And when you do, let me know what you found. I'll talk to you guys soon. Adios.